Okay, so now that we have all of our clips in place, the next thing we're gonna talk about is adding transitions. The way to get to that is clicking this button right over here, it looks like a little lightning bolt, and that's gonna take you to the folder with all of the transitions in it. Um, they have packed a whole ton of transitions in here. Um, the two that I want to um, talk about first are gonna be these two right here, but before we talk about those, what I wanna do is show you once again where to adjust the default transition length. And the way to do that is to go to Project Preferences here, and right here it says Transitions. Um, this one is currently set to two seconds. I like to have my transitions a little shorter, and so I'm gonna make them one second long and hit OK. And now every time I insert a transition between my clips here, it's gonna be one second instead of two seconds. I find that two seconds is maybe just a little bit too long and I lose too much of the video before and after um, and draw a lot of attention to the transition itself, which I don't really like to do. So um, the first two that I wanna talk about are these two right here. This one is a fade up and fade out. Uh, fade down uh, transition. You can see what it does over here um, and actually if you put it between two clips then it actually will fade down and then fade back up to the second one. Um, most often this transition is used at the very beginning or the very end of a movie. So if I take it and I drag it down here to the very start then it's going to fade up from black and right in to my video, just like that. Um, then also I can take it and put it at the very end of my movie and it'll do uh, exactly the same thing. So if I just hit, uh, hit uh, play here, it's gonna just fade out at the very last scene there, okay? Um, so that is the fade in and fade out. The next one I wanna show you is the dissolve. This one actually cross fades between two video clips. So as one is fading out, the other one is fading in. Um, this is a really nice transition because it's a little softer than a straight cut, meaning uh, no transition at all, but it actually adds um, a little bit of warmth to the transition and that can sometimes represent the passage of time. 